Greetings Droid Forms fans, this is David Storm here to bring you a quick hands-on review of the next lock screen app from Microsoft. We're going to jump right in with our trusty Nexus 5 and see what benefits this new lock screen app contains. First, as you can see here, uh, it replaces the backdrop of the lock screen. You can actually customize that, which is kind of interesting. Uh, you can set it to at home, on the go, or at work, whichever one looks handy enough to you. Um, also, you can see your calendar app is, is showing all your different calendar uh, appointments right here on the lock screen, which is the, the main uh, advantage of uh, that, that Microsoft hopes that you will like the app for. Uh, it has a unique feature which I, I didn't have a way to set up which is that if you have a conference call coming up you can actually click on the conference call and it'll automatically go directly into the conference call it'll punch in your code and connect you to the call. In this instance I don't have one going on but you can at least see how the uh, app works as far as getting in. Um, in that instance I had to manually put in the code. Um, now to come back out of it to show some of these other features. Uh, the other thing that we have is uh, you have a, a, a number of different customizable apps that you can put right on the lock screen. For example, you can even have like the flashlight you can see there. Um, what's really neat about it is, it is it's customizable. You can uh, go edit apps, you can remove something that you don't like and add something else in there. Um, and just to, to get right into your normal screen, you just swipe down and then at that point you enter your code. Now normally I don't use a code, but I set one up for uh, this particular little uh, quick hands-on. Uh, ultimately, I think that the app is, uh, can be pretty useful if you're somebody who needs to get into those types of apps quickly uh, and you're in your lock screen. Um, for the most part, it feels like an extra step to me though. Um, I guess it really depends on, on how productive and how quick you need to be. Uh, ultimately, I think Microsoft has made a pretty decent little app um, and for some users could be quite handy, um, which means that the, the 3.9 star rating it gets on Microsoft's site uh, seems to be pretty accurate. That's about it. Thanks for watching.